Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you again so much for our time together. Trying a different camera today. A good friend of mine, Brother Claude from Australia, sent me a DX01. And so now I'm trying just hooking things up to an iPad and do what they call vlogging. We'll see how this works. All right. Right now, I want us to come back to the book of Jeremiah, chapter 32 and 33. Some fantastic passages that we have here today. For instance, I mean, you, you get over here and go, uh, it never entered into my mind. We see things that God never entered into his mind. We see the great promises of how prosperity brings awe into people's hearts. We see God's heart as a blesser in, in verses 40 and 41. But I want us to go to chapter 33, and I want us to look at verse 12. This is what the Lord Almighty says. In this place, desolate, without men or animals, in all its towns, there will again be pasture for shepherds to rest their flocks. Now, you need to underline that passage there, especially if you're a leader, to rest their flocks. I want you to remember Psalms 23, that a good shepherd makes the sheep lie down in green pastures. I want you to remember back to Jacob in the book of Genesis where he told his brother Esau, I, I, can't, I can't come with you. I can't move that quickly because of the little ones and the, the baby lambs. And we, we can't move too fast. I want you to understand that a wise leader understands there's a time to work and then there's a time when the flock needs to rest. Now, most congregations you don't have this problem with because, you know, they're not doing a lot of work. Forgive me. But COP, sometimes you need to understand that we need to slow the pace down just a little bit. You have worked so hard. We've built so much in the last few years. We've built East Campus Cash. We've built South Campus Cash. We've built the Student Center Cash. We've built Davao Cash. We've built a radio station, 100 million pesos cash. God has, God has been good to us. And yes, God gave us the seed to sow. But then sometimes we just need to lay down in green pastures and rest a little bit. There's nothing wrong with that. Let's take 2018, we'll rest, we'll get our harvest flowing in. But let's, let's understand that a wise leader understands that people can't push all the time. Connect group leaders. We work hard in evangelism, and we work hard in evangelism, we work hard in evangelism. But sometimes you just need to take a month or so and lay, say, let's just meet together and pray together and study our Bibles together and pray for one another and let's rest a little bit this month. There's nothing wrong with that. A wise leader knows the flock must rest. Mm -hmm.